Welcome to Comic Power. I am your host, Comic Killer 72 Today I'm doing another Comics for Sale video. These are hot comics that you can buy directly from me on eBay. What I'm offering today is not graded by CBCS or CGC. But I'll give you a breakdown on the estimated grades. Since these auctions have been so exciting, I'm doing another 99 cent no reserve sale. No reserve means there's no minimum. Whatever it sells for is what it sells for. There's no safety net. So if it sells for three bucks, it sells for three bucks. But that's usually not the case because there's usually last minute bidding wars. But it's fun because everybody has an equal opportunity to bid on it. My main homepage at eBay that I sell at is listed here, but I will have specific links in the comment section as well. So now that you understand, let's get into the details of what I'm offering. And that's going to be Star Wars, the first 10 issues from the continuity that started in 2015. They had this over to Jason Aaron, who, in my opinion, is the best writer in comics to head it. He didn't disappoint in building the universe, and the artwork is spectacular. These comics are canon to the Star Wars universe, and the details of what's happening in the events happen after New Hope and before Empire Strikes Back. Even more exciting is that four of the 10 issues listed here are action figure variants. Let's quickly go over the details of all 10 issues. Issue number one has the print cast of the royal family. My estimated grade of this copy is about 9.2 out of 10. Issue number two has Han and Chewie. Looks like they're in big trouble from Darth Vader. I rate this about 9.6 out of 10. Issue number three has a real cool cover which shows Luke taking on some stormtroopers. It's about 9.6 out of 10. Issue number four is a action figure variant of Chewie. This is a very important issue because it's the first appearance of Setostoros who claims to be the estranged wife of Han Solo. On the left is the interior page of issue number four where she meets Greedo's family. Yes, the same guy that Han shot first, even if George Lucas tried to change it later, which is a complete disgrace. Whole other story. On the right is a frame from issue number six where she makes her first full appearance and embarrasses Han in front of Leia who has no idea who this woman is. Issue number five is a C-3PO action figure variant. It's about 9.4 out of 10. Issue number six is a R2-D2 variant. It's about a 9.8 out of 10. Issue number seven is a Stormtrooper action figure variant. It's about a 9.6 out of 10. Issue eight has another gorgeous Luke cover with R2-D2. It's about a 9.6 out of 10. Issue number nine is the first cover appearance of Santa Storos, who's not getting along with Princess Leia. It's about a 9.4 out of 10. And issue number 10 has Luke taking on a monster. It's about a 9.2 out of 10. So, as I stated earlier, you get all 10 issues in one bundle and the bidding starts at just 99 cents. The auction is going to end on Thursday night at 10.02 p.m. Eastern Time. Also, this auction has no reserve. Whatever it goes for is what it goes for. So, happy bidding. This Star Wars bundle is not the only thing in my eBay page. There are other great keys that are offered as a buy now, such as Spider-Man number one from early 2016. This is the Miles Morales version where he's incorporated in the 616 universe for the first time. And this is the tremendously popular hip hop variant where Marvel was paying homage to Nas's 1994 hip hop classic Illmatic. Hip hop fans that never bought comics buy these, so they're pretty rare now because they're getting scooped up left and right. The copy I'm selling is about 9.4 out of 10. And I'm asking $16.99. If you're a Jack Kirby disciple, I have this Machine Man number one from 1978. This is not his first appearance, but it is his first ongoing series. Jack Kirby created this character and he wrote and drew this first issue. It's about 8.5 out of 10 and I'm asking $14.99. And then there's X-Men number 267. This is the second appearance of Gambit in comics. It's about a 9.0 first print and I'm asking $10 for it. There are dozens and dozens of more good books out there. You got nothing to worry about as well. I've been selling on eBay since 2012 and I have 958 feedback reviews. I am 100%. I ship comics flat with enough protection to survive a nuclear blast. The raw copies are buy now, so you don't have to compete with anybody. If you like the prices, you can just go ahead and buy them. Remember, the Star Wars bundle is an auction, and it ends Thursday night at 10.02 p.m. Eastern Time on September 14th. I don't just talk about comics at this channel. I also sell them. So if you trust what I say at this channel, you should trust what I sell as well. Once again, in the comment section, I will have links for all this stuff that I'm talking about. This is Comic Killer 72 saying happy bidding and bye bye.